Hello, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to the series of triceps exercise. So today we are going to analyze and understand the exercise that is dumbbell overhead extension. This exercise mainly targets your larger end of your triceps. Why this exercise will target the larger end of your triceps? That we will discuss in the another video. That will take more time to explain. And then, so now we will understand the technical part of the dumbbell overhead extension by using load and force diagram. So you can see the initial position, at the initial position this is your shoulder, elbow and wrist. So you are carrying a dumbbell here, that means the load is acting downwards and you are creating a force because you need to lift the weight. Okay. So you are extending your elbow, that means the load is going up. The force you should create in this direction. And this is the initial position. So once you come to the final position, Actually, you created a force and then the load is up. Then, at this position also, the force is exactly opposite to the load. You can see here, force is opposite to the load in the final position also. Now, let me show you this. So, if you are carrying a dumbbell, okay, before that, before learning these techniques, how I was doing, I will show you that also. So, before learning these techniques, I was keeping a dumbbell here and I was taking it forward. I was doing this. By taking it forward. So you can see here the force is acting in this direction. That means the force you are generating is in this direction. But the load always, because you are carrying a dumbbell, it will be always acting down. So I read it here. The force will act in this direction, the load will act in this direction. That means, at the final position, if you are doing that way, at the final position, the force and load is not as well coupled to the opposite to each other. That's the reason, once I learned this one, so I started performing like this. This is the initial position, the tension is there in the triceps. From here, take it up. Instead of taking forward, you should take the dumbbell up. The advantage is there will be very least stress in your joint and then the force is exactly opposite to the load. That means tension is whatever the load which you are carrying is completely carried from the triceps only and tension is also proper. So this is completely of technical part. Okay, there is one more thing. So this will come in muscle to man connection directly. This here is a deadly. That means from wrist to here is a deadly. Because none of the muscles you are using here, so you are using only triceps. So basically, when you are doing this one, you should make sure from this to here it is deadly. Imagine that is there is nothing here. Okay. Or else one more thing I can tell you. So just assume there is an elastic rubber here. You are pulling this rubber so that the weight is coming up. Or this link is coming up. You are pulling the rubber so that the weight is coming up. Okay. So, I will explain this uh, clearly in the practical section. So, let's move on to the practical. So, we will be explaining the practical thing like practically how to do a dumbbell extension properly. So, RS is helping me for that. So, let's start with the wrong form. So, turn that side. So, clearly you can see here he is doing it wrong. From here he is taking it forward. So the force he is creating in this direction, it is going in this direction because he is taking it forward. But what we uh, learn from the technical part is, so what we need to do, instead of taking it forward, we need to leave it, you will keep your elbow here and then we should maintain, dumbbell should be always in this direction, dumbbell should not be like this. If it is like this, when you are carrying heavy weight, it will create a pressure on your wrist more. So it should be always like this, assume that you are leaving the dumbbell away from you and then you are carrying, you are taking up away from you. So what you need to do now, so from here take it up. So you should generate a force in this direction. Take it down here, dumbbell should be like this only, take it up. So let him do one, two, one, three more repetition. Take it more up, more up, more, more, stretch completely, flex completely, feel the muscle here. So this is your larger of your triceps. Take it up, more. 
So this is how you should perform uh, the dumbbell tricep extension. This is word extension. That's it. I hope you guys understood the both theoretical and the practical part. Uh, if you have any doubts, please ping me in the uh, comment section or I will give you my Instagram handle. You can just uh, DM me your questions and your doubts. I will try to answer that, those questions in my next video. I hope you guys like this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe my channel. And turn on the notification. Whenever I upload the video, you will get the notification. I will see you in the next video. Until then, stay fit, stay healthy, stay happy. Bye-bye.